Welcome back, everybody, to the Amazing Spider-Man Fan. And I'd like to thank all of you for swinging in and checking out this video. So, if you are new, please make sure you subscribe and leave a like. Because it really does help out my channel. So, with all said, let's get into it. So, Hasbro has shown official images for brand new Marvel Legends uh, that are coming out pretty soon. And I want to have a look at them. Uh, so, having a look at the first one, we're only getting two. So, the first one we're having a look at is White Rabbit, who looks pretty good. She comes with, like, this umbrella with this glowing thing at it, which I am guessing uh, is, like, a gun or something like that. Now, I am not familiar with this character whatsoever, so I don't really know who she is, okay? So, um, yeah, I'm sort of having trouble. People are saying that she's a Spider-Man villain. I've never heard of her in my life. But I do think she looks cool. The sculpt is pretty good. Uh, she kind of reminds me of, like, a clown, almost. It's kind of what she reminds me of. But she has this nice white suit, which is pretty cool. She's got these boots that are nice and fluffy, uh, which are nice. And she's got, like, the clown gloves. You know, she's kind of got those white gloves that kind of look like, uh, clowns would wear. Uh, she comes with this blue jacket. Uh, she's also sculpted a, they also got sculpted a, uh, like a watch or something that's, wrapped around uh, her gut area uh, but I do think she looks pretty good um, she looks nice she's got the white mask on and she's got the rabbit ears pointing out of her hair I think she looks great the articulation does look pretty good on the uh, on this figure but moving on to someone I really really love Dr. Otto Octavius from the Superior uh, Spider-Man line of comics and uh, he looks awesome. I do believe this is when Doc Ock takes over Peter Parker's body. He sort of stays as Dr. Octavius a little bit. I do believe that's what he does. And uh, he sort of has his brand new suit and everything and he just looks awesome. I really like him a lot. He's got white and, and black and green and all these colors just mixed together really really well. Uh, he's also got his tentacles um, and I really do hope we get Benny Wire in them because we've gotten a Doc Ock figure a few months ago, and even though that figure is awesome, there was no Benny Wire in the arms, and that was really disappointing to me. But I do hope we get the Benny Wire in the arms, uh, for this Octavius, and I'll be really, really happy with him. So, like I said, the colors just mix together real well. He's got like this octopus on his chest that's all green and it just looks amazing really does pop really makes the figure look alive just, it's awesome he's got these goggle things on that are green as well it's just so cool i love it a lot it's awesome and of course he's got like little like green things at his arm so the mixture of green black and gray and white just come together real well on this figure and the body mold looks really good, so I think we're going to get a lot of articulation out of this guy. So, I really love this figure. I love it a lot. So, I am really impressed. The White Rabbit doesn't really impress me that much. And like I said, it's just because I don't know anything about her, thus she doesn't surprise me. I can't even tell you if she is a Spider-Man villain or not. Uh, that's how much I don't know about her. But, I know a lot about Octavius. And he's from the Superior Spider-Man comics. I do believe this is the one from Superior Comics. Uh, so I like him a lot. I'm a huge fan of Dr. Octavius. So I think this figure is amazing. So that's my thoughts on it. I want to hear your thoughts down in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you later.